In this video, I'm going to show you how to really easily get started with Stable Diffusion Deforum to make some crazy animations. So we're going to be using a website called Replicate, and Replicate makes it super easy to run some of these machine learning models that are coming out. It's kind of like Google Colab, except for it doesn't require any configuration. You can just um, kind of type in your settings and hit go. You don't need to run different scripts and installation files and things like that. Replicate already does all of that for you. And uh, here we're just kind of looking through some of the different models that they have available on the site. And I actually am starting a new account here so to show you from the beginning how to go ahead and do this. So we can go ahead and sign in and authenticate with GitHub to create a new account. There we go. And now we can go to explore and search for the machine learning model that we want to run in the cloud, which is Stable Diffusion to Forum. And for those that haven't used this yet, this is a tool that is a text to video tool. So you type in a prompt description um, and we can indicate here at frame zero, this is what we want to show. So that way you can make different subjects for different frames. And we're going to type in our prompt description here at frame zero. And so this tool will take this description and then, as you can see on the right, create an animation uh, based on the image description that you're writing. And we can also change the settings, things like angle and zoom, uh, zooming in and out and panning on the X and Y axis to determine how the video looks um, after the generation. So we just configure our settings here and replicate and hit submit. And the Replicate server will start to run that process for us. They give us a, a free, a few free credits. And then after that, you do have to pay to use the computing power. Um, it's about a dollar per video I've found for about 200 frames. And there we go. Here's our outputted video. So this is a super simple way to try out Stable Diffusion to Forum for the first few times. And I hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching.